Uh, hello YouTube. So today I'm going to show you how to root the LG9, LG90, and also how to update it to Android Lollipop. But the first step will be to update it to Android Lollipop stock and then root it with uh, the LG root script. Now this is for people that have the Android KitKat installed on their system. Now you're going to need these files right here, LG Flash Tool. Uh, D4 1520B and the LG drivers so I already installed the drivers and I already extracted in my LG flash tool so your first step is first to install the LG United mobile drivers there's um, there will be a link for all these files in the description and this the KDZ this is and um, lollipop for your D4 uh, 415 gonna drag this over here so drag it in and you should have here so this is this is your lollipop so once you install this the drivers on your computer you're gonna extract the LG flash tool and you're gonna get this folder so from this folder you're gonna drag the KDZ which we just did so right here I dragged it and it's here so your next step should be uh, taking out the battery of your phone, put it back in. So put it back in. Hold power, power, um, volume up only. Don't touch power. Just volume up, and plug in your cable. But make sure you keep holding uh, volume up. Right. See. So now you just got this message on your phone. Firmware update, do not plug the USB. So that's great. And we're gonna go back to the computer. Oh, well, we're in the computer, so you're gonna go ahead and open LG Flash Tool 2014 and run as administrator. Make sure uh, your drivers are installing before you do this. And you should get this window right here. So you're going to hit, you're going to select CDMA, DAG, everything's fine. Now you're going to hit this little, hit this little folder to select the KDZ right here, D4. 11520B and okay so if you hit CSE flash uh, I'm warning you the phone is gonna be reset be reset to factory default so it's gonna delete everything on your phone so make sure you back back up everything so do CSE flash and you're gonna just hit start okay so your phone you should, you should get a pop-up menu saying select your country or language and just do OK. And now you just wait a couple of minutes and the phone should start upgrading or and you should see the screen LG mobile support. Now if, if you notice I keep dragging my windows it's because I have uh, uh, two screens so this is how I'm recording. Now you're gonna give it f maybe uh, five minutes before this is done. So I'll be I'll pause the video and come back. Uh, right now, by now the phone should have booted up. It should be booting up. And after this, you should have Android. Android uh, lollipop, but it's stock. Now, if you want to root it, I'm gonna show you right now also how to root the phone. And just give it a minute, a couple of minutes before it turns on. So right now, it's done, and I'm just gonna hit exit. Okay, you can just close this window, and you should get a screen saying that it's upgrading. Um, 
and also you could just wait probably give it 10 minutes not even five minutes uh, you should have lollipop now and as you can see right here on my screen down there uh, it's lo lollipop if you notice that's the how it looks but we're gonna verify right now it's asking me to sign in I'm not gonna sign in next and skip that so we're just gonna go through all these steps and I'm, if, you, if you want you can put your information I'm just skipping for the sake of the video plug this for a moment and as you can see we have lollipop this is the official lollipop from T-Mobile once again this is only for the T-Mobile variant if I haven't mentioned and we're gonna go with software info and you have 5.2 point 5.02 so you have Android lollipop installed okay so we have lollipop installed right so you're just gonna um, we're gonna now root the phone and you're just gonna go first we're gonna go to settings uh, about and we're gonna go to software info then you're gonna go to bill number we're gonna enable developer you hit you tap four times and you're now a developer so hit back and you should see developer options now this is an option if you want to if not you're set to go you already have lollipop and you can enable USB debugging. Hit OK. And we're done here. So now you're just going to plug in your USB. And we're going to go to the computer now. Now to root the LG on Lollipop. You're gonna need this folder LG root script. This is where we have the files to root the phone. I will I will also provide the link down below, so no problem with it. And the only thing you need to do is run the LG root script. Now when you, when you do this, um, the uh there's a pop up. It's gonna show up on your phone, so you're gonna hit accept, and you're just gonna run administrator. And you should get a you should get a, a, a file like this right here on your phone. You should see some some sort of window. You're just gonna hit always allow from the computer and hit OK. And now right there it says pushing. Once you see pushing files and rebooting, it means it's working. And your phone should have rebooted also at the same time. Now the good thing is the benefits of rooting is you can remove the T-Mobile stock apps. I mean it takes up space in your in your phone, and this phone only has eight gigs, but you can use an SD card for for the, for music and all that. Okay, so right now it rebooted once, and and it's telling you if you don't see the Super SU installer script on your phone, then that means your your phone fail to to be rooted but it should be done so we're just gonna press right here press control C and then press and type in so control C and hit N enter and done that's it your phone should be rooted so benefits of rooting your phone is uh, you can remove the T-Mobile adware or they call it bloat and bloatware and with this you have you have a cleaner phone and uh it makes it faster since you're removing some applications that keep running like like lookout or the amazon app store so your phone should be booting up and starting services now we're done in the computer so go back to your phone and we're gonna see if it worked now we can look for 
an app called Super SU, and here it is. So right now you just rooted your phone in Android Lollipop. Let's see, Super SU. Store the brightness. So right here, Super SU. And well, it's just a message. Don't worry, Grant. And that's it. So your phone, it's an Lollipop and it's rooted. So now you're ready to use a uh, titanium backup and remove and all these apps you see the uh, Think Reviewer, this dictionary, uh, you just look, look out T Mobile stuff, you can remove all of that and you should have a clean phone so guys thanks for watching and subscribe and if you have any questions uh, go ahead and comment I'll try to answer them as soon as possible uh, thank you